Enter. Hey, Miss Young. Hey, Miss Young. Get your shirt and your tie. Take your hat off. And I'll have that phone, thank oh, you. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Sorry, Miss Young. What's happening? So, we've come up with some pretty awesome ideas about muck up day. You mean activities day? <laughs> activities day. Activities day. Yeah. Yes. And what are they? Um, well, the first idea I had, which, uh, well, I was going to gather all the boys up and then we were going to like just run through the den and, you know, just like the school and cause havoc and, you know, chaos and maybe break some, you know, just break some stuff like the few doors, maybe some, some keys. Like the stop. You reckon that's a good idea? Yeah. That's yeah. ridiculous. What else? What have you got, Holly? Well, I was thinking, grab some glad wrap. Just wrap my little brother up to a tree. Mm, that's that's not good. Uh, yeah, th thank you, thank you. Bit of common sense. What that's would great. be better is if we wrapped them all to a tree. All <laughs> the little kids. <laughs> oh. no, 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 no. You got any? You got any decent ideas? Well, we were thinking maybe for the final day assembly, just get a couple of Year Twelves up on stage. Talk about people who have dated, people who have kissed, people who have... No, 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 I'm not doing that again. I'm not doing that again. Have you got anything that is half decent? Well, I, I... I think we might. I think I, we might. I think we can take it from here. Okay, girls, who were your first crushes? First crush. First crush. First crush. First crush. First crush. Ben Sorak. Ben Huffman. Nick Conway. Rosie Riley. Hey Holly, who was your first crush at college? Look, probably Nick Conway. Yes. yes. Who was your first crush? Chan Acker. Maddie Landos. Julian Selway. Charlie Mitchell. Rosie Briley. Who what have you been up to uh, this lunchtime? I've been going to the gym. <laughs> <laughs> and who was your first college crush? Um. Do I really have to answer that? <laughs> <laughs> Nettie, who was your first crush at college? Um, my first crush at college was Sam Malone. Patty Ho. Georgia Caravitas. Um, ben Sell. Eliza Walsh. Emily O'Brien. Rosie Briley. Nick Conway. Ben Sell. Who were your first crushes at college, boys? Uh, Grace Carroll. Grace Carroll. Oh, Grace Carroll. <laughs> Who was your first crush at college? Um, I think Jarrison was. <laughs> <laughs> so, Will, who was your first crush at college? <laughs> Uh, Lou Morgan. And you too? Uh, Connie Clodger. <laughs> Laura Billings. <laughs> ben Sill or Ben Stark, not sure which one. <laughs> I'd probably have to say Pado. Sorry, Alex. Um, uh, Hannah Walker. And Hannah, first crush? Uh, Nick Cronus in year seven. <laughs> <laughs> Nick Conway? Well, I came from Colac, so everyone really. I'm a Jackie. Will Page. Uh, year 5, Jeremy Goddard. Oh, year 7, Nick oh. Conway. <laughs> year 3, Jeremy Goddard. <laughs> In a sense, you could say our lives are literally being powered by electricity. Even items that don't require electricity to function almost definitely require electricity to be manufactured. I can't wait for a meat pie. Wait, did you know that the beef that you were planning on putting into your mouth accounts for over 13% of global greenhouse gas emissions which contribute to climate change? Wow, I didn't know that. So does that mean that I can't eat meat at all? Not at all. In fact, most meats are produced in a much more sustainable way and do not contribute anywhere near as much to global emissions as beef does. So can I still eat my KFC? Yeah, but diabetes is your own responsibility. Hey guys, um, today we're going to be doing a prac and basically going to consist of my colleagues, um, Gus, and Ben, and they're going to be basically playing some basketball um, and working up a sweat and um, showing you guys how sweating can really cool you off in hot situations. So, um, yeah, 
get ready for this. Okay, so time for a little bit of 1v1 ball. 1v1 ball, let's go. Two hours later. Physically exerting yourself in the sun, it really takes a toll. And all this sweat you can see on my colleagues here is because the body's way of cooling them down in the hot sun is by making them wet. Because making them wet <laughs> means they'll get cold. Thank you. <laughs> this is great banter. It really is. Thanks, Thanks for listening. What skills and attributes will be needed in a person who is prepared to undertake the trip? We will need a person that is prepared to take risks to discover the unknown. We will also need a team that covers a wide range of skills such as piloting, engineering and a navigator. So, it's a big day Martin. <laughs> yeah. How do you feel about meeting your new birth mother? <coughs> Uh, all sorts of things. Um, I, I feel great, you know. Uh, I would have been, I felt very wrong to have me. Oh, I can't believe I'm meeting my mother today. I'm so nervous, I can't believe I'm saying that. Mm. So, you ready to meet your mum? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 <coughs> okay, Julie, you can bring in Diane, please. Yes, yeah, sure. Come in, Diane. With all these people, the broth is still no good. You, so you really can't have too many chefs to work on the broth. And having all these chefs has a detrimental effect on the broth. So Chan, who's your favourite teacher? Uh, Mr. Smith. Nice. And uh, you, Nick? Yeah, probably Al Smith as well. Nice, Al Smith. Mr. Smith. Same. Mr. Matthews. <laughs> Miss Gibbs. Mr. Smith, the Envari one, 100%. Yeah, great guy. And uh, you, Lily? 
Trump's Haji. Oh God, so, uh, Miss Van Cleef. I'd say Miss Van Cleef. Um, if this counts, I'd say Mr. Donovan, even though he's not here this year. Probably Miss Newitt. Miss Atkins. My favourite teacher. Mr. Smith from Enviro. Oh, I have to say the same, actually. Yeah, yeah. Al Smith. <laughs> so I'm here with the up and coming influencer and YouTuber, Amber Whitley. <laughs> so, who is your first crush? Miss Taylor. Oh. Favourite um, teacher? Yeah. Naughty, what about you? Uh, first crush was definitely Jolly Mitchell. <laughs> and favourite teacher would probably be a day. Who? Oh, my oh, my God. God. <laughs> and Claire. Favourite crush? My first crush. <laughs> um, oh, definitely <laughs> Conway. Oh, my God. Um, and favourite teacher is <laughs> Miss Hines. Um, first crush in college. Miss McKinnon. <laughs> yeah, same. <laughs> ah, Cordy was mine. Ah, oh. oh. uh, year seven, Evan Jones. <laughs> <laughs> year six, Nick Coronas. Charlie Middleton. <laughs> Evan. Ooh, um, yeah, I guess Jackman. <laughs> Ollie Cotton. <laughs> I think maybe Jack's cross. Oh. Uh, first crush. Oh, let's go. Charlie Hosking. Uh, who was your first crush in year seven? Uh, in year seven? Uh, it would have been Rose Hosking, I reckon. Whoa. <laughs> Hello, who was your first crush in year seven? Yeah, um, Rose Hosking as well. <laughs> what about you, mate? Oh, Charlie Hosking. Patty Ho. Yeah. Yeah. Favourite teacher? Mr. Terry. Agnes Timms. Claude and Sarah, who are your first college crushes? Um, Mitch. <laughs> no one's gonna come. Look, it's already seven o'clock, and there's no one here. Yes, they will. Don't worry. Oh, no, no, show this up. is your fault. Oh, I'm sorry. You have to send out the invitations. You literally only had one job, and you can't even do it right. Look, here's someone now. So I've just gotten back from America, I've been at MIT, nice. and now I've been accepted for astronaut candidacy. But I'm broke, wow. but it's incredible. Well, it? yeah. Yeah. well done. Oh, no, I can't. Um, just the astronaut thing. Oh. Not allowed to drink at all. Okay. Cool. Thanks anyway. Well, But, oh, sorry, I just need to take this from Anna Winter. Oh, wow, yeah, go for it. Anna, I told you Chanel on page five. What do you need now? Maybe I 
I don't need to go on the bachelorette anymore. <laughs> so guys, good to see you. Thanks for coming. Um, how have you been? Like, have you made any new music lately or anything? Or? <laughs> how have we ever? <laughs> Okay guys, who was your favourite teacher at college? Um, for me it's Mr. Kolbachev. Uh, to me, I think um, both uh, Spash and Mathis, Mr. Smith. So Ben, who was your first crush? Um, Miss O'Callaghan probably. Favourite teacher? <laughs> Miss O'Callaghan. Nice. Miss Newitt. Plenty. Mrs. Watson. Hey Rekis, do you have a farewell message for all the year 12s? I do. It's goodbye and it's um, good luck. <laughs> Who was your favourite teacher at college? Miss mm, Palche. In Byron, Mr. Smith. Um, mine's Miss Hurton. Um, Mrs. Barnes. Miss Watson. For sure. And I'm Mr. Cobbleton. Um, Miss Jackman. <laughs> oh! Probably Miss Marnie. Like, she was pretty awesome. But, like, you know, a little bit crazy, but she's great. <laughs> Definitely Miss Nail for me. It's, it's just all I had. Do you have a message for the Year 12s, Levy? For my children. Uh, Keith, yes. Uh, I wish you all the best. Uh, stay green. But remember, you need to do a practice exam for every study score that you would like. Oh, boys, who was your first crush? Uh, Liv Batten. Um, probably Cecilia, I reckon. Alex Booker. Uh, Lily Morgan. Probably Ava. Ben Sell. Jeremy Goddard. Yeah. Year 7, we'll pay. Yeah, Year 7, Jeremy Goddard. Uh, naughty 40 in Year 8. <laughs> <laughs> All the way back in grade prep for me, Louise Cairns. Uh, back in Year 6, Zoe Sander. <laughs> Matty Landon. Isla Watson. Jacinta Padani. Uh, Lily Edwards in Year 7. Uh, Charlie Hosky in Year 8. Probably Rosie Briley in Year 7. Oh, Georgie Roderick, year 10. Okay, Connor, who was your first crush at college? Well, Jolene, but she turned me gay. <laughs> well, I mean, I feel like everybody sort of had the same crush. We went to Chilwell, so shout out to Nick Conway. Do you have a farewell message for the year 12s? I do, Jess, after they leave. Be good, and if you can't be good, don't get caught. <laughs> so, Echo, who was your first crush? Nick Coronas. Georgia Caravitas. My first crush was Claudia. <laughs> So Lisa, who was your first crush at college? Well, going back to year five, I'd have to say it's Luke Dirksen. Hello year 12s. I would like to wish you all the very best for the next month and or so ahead. Remember, don't ever let a number define you. 
You have been an amazing year level to work with. Next year, I wish you love, resilience, and remember, no one's there to hold your hand. So enjoy the next month, all the very best, and we'll always be here for you. So Scout, who's your favourite teacher? Um, can I have two? Yeah, okay, well obviously Miss Knight, because she runs the boarding house, and mm -hmm. she's like a mum to me. Um, and then Mr. Smith in the arts department, my art teacher in year 11 and I cried when I found out he wouldn't be my teacher for year 12. I love him a lot. He always wears blue. I don't know why. Definitely been a few but Kay Flam would probably be one of them. Just give me a good giggle now and then. Good bloke. Uh, probably my economics teacher Mr Morris aka Daddy Possum. Oh uh, hello. I'm year 12 Calvert Tutor. Here are my beautiful two T's sitting behind me. I have had the best four years with this group. They have been absolutely wonderful and I want to wish them all the best in their exams and all the best in the rest of their life. Thank you.